Ancient Japan, Heian period. Many people know the story of the brave warrior, Minamoto no Yoshitsune, but the story of his loyal retainer, Musashi Bodenke, is not as widely known. Benkei was a person with an unusual birth history. His mother carried him in her womb for 18 months, or even three years, and when he was born, he already had the physique of a three-year-old child. He spent his childhood in Sanjo Kyodoku, in Kyoto, and was later entrusted to the Enyakuji Temple on Mount Hai. However, his violent nature caused him to be hated by the other monks, and he was expelled. He returned to Kyoto and made a vow to steal 1,000 swords, and after stealing 999 swords, he encountered Minamoto no Yoshitsune at the Gojo Tenjin Shrine. Benkei attacked Yoshitsune, but Yoshitsune stopped in midair, sword, and dodged Benkei's sword. The next night, at the Kiyomiza Temple Festival, Benkei found Yoshitsune again, and attacked him, but was once again repelled. In the final battle on the Kiyomiza stage, Benkei was defeated by Yoshitsune, and they formed a master-servant bond. Benkei served Yoshitsune thereafter, and played an active role in many battles. Ultimately, he met his end at the Iwaidogawa Palace, in Hiraizumi, along with Yoshitsune, in the Benkei Hall of Chusenji Temple. There are statues of Minamoto no Yoshitsune, who committed suicide at Iwaidogawa Palace, and Benkei, who is said to have died standing up. The story of Minamoto no Yoshitsune and Benkei is still loved by many people today, and their achievements are honored with bronze statues, and the like.